So the stocking program started in memory of Ed Pacheco, who was um, our lead custodian here at Junction for many years. And he was just really great at bringing people together and taking care of what everyone needs and checking in. And so um, our, that's why our program started last year, was in memory of Ed. And so he's, he's still just pushing it forward and making awesome programs come out of this school. Hello, my name is Jared Burek. I'm one of the uh, assistant principals at Grand Junction High School and uh, I just wanted to uh, share a little bit about this holiday project. You know, the, the folks that uh, are running this project will be able to share a lot of the details, but uh, you know, we're extremely proud of this holiday project here at Grand Junction High School. So I wanted to, you know, uh, provide a special thanks to, you know, all those folks who have contributed to this project as it's, you know, as it's grown this year substantially. So special thanks, uh, you know, go to Michaela Manchester, Karen Provenza, Jody Cronk, Jen Solnier, Brenda Pomeroy, you know, they put a lot of, uh, you know, time and effort into making this holiday project what it is. Uh, and then obviously a, a big thank you goes to our community, our staff, you know, the community in Grand Junction High School who, who have contributed uh, to this holiday project. Um, you know, as Michaela will be able to explain to you as she talks about all the details of the project, you know, it's, it's, gonna, it's gonna support 50 or more families this year. And, and as we all know right now, you know, as we try to, get through this pandemic and we try to support one another as a community, projects like this are, are essential. So again, you know, thank you to all those who contributed and special thanks to, you know, some of our folks here at the building who have really put in, you know, a lot of time and energy to make this happen. So our project here, it started a couple, well, it started last year with our awesome ladies in the front office and some of the teachers and Mrs. Cronk, they put together um, stockings for a number of students that were referred to us that um, we've fi figured they can maybe use some help having a, a more special holiday season at home. So they filled stockings with candy and hats and gloves and all sorts of fun things for the students and sent them home. So we wanted to do the same project this year and so we have 50 stockings filled for 50 different students that got referred to us through their counselors, teachers, people who knew that they could use a little help. Um, so we extended that, we built on it this year. We decided to send a wish list form home and see what families and students could use. So the students submitted a form that said, this year we really need a gift card so we can go out as a family for dinner, or we really need hats and gloves in this house, or my mom really wants some self, some something something nice i don't know anything anyone that they could shop for they sent what they needed and so we were able to fill um 47 family wishes and student wishes um just by the graciousness of everyone in our community we've had some really awesome individuals and um, groups step up